Let's uh, the we could quickly look at a ruble. <laughs> okay, so what do you think happened to the ruble here? It's kind of funny. Here's 2020. Here's 2021. Boom. October 25th, 2021. What happened here? February 14th, 2022. What happened here? Well, this is when Russia invaded Ukraine. Look at that. Everyone was like, oh, we're not going to support you. We're going to sanction you, blah, 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 blah. Their currency went down basically 50% in what was three weeks. Kind of crazy when you think about it. It's even more crazy what happened after, though. Don't matter what happened before. What really matters happened after. From there, we then saw an increase in, <laughs> in the Russian ruble of 200% in 100 days, just over three months. An entire country's currency appreciated 200% and is now stronger than ever. It is, it literally touched a five year all time high. Yeah. Post invading Ukraine. Sure, they were mad at them for about three weeks, but literally. It, it came back stronger than ever and is currently up since they went into Ukraine. Kind of funny when you think about it, right? Kind of weird. Meanwhile, look at those trend lines coming in here. It went up, touched basically that range. Look at that. Sell off here. I'll mark it. that it's, it's interesting less to be said about this one should i get to the juicy stuff um personally 